we are going to see how to use um, index and match to look for values. Um, we saw that VLOOKUP has a problem, uh, two main problems. One, uh, if you need to find a value to the left of where you're, you're searching for the original values, you can't. You can only look to the right. And then it can only, uh, um, you can only look for one value using one condition. So for example, uh, look for the value ILX in this table and give me, return the column five. But you cannot look where ILX is, where C, in the C column where you have ILX and in the D you have something else. You can't have two conditions. Uh, formulas, index and, and um, match, uh, you, you solve this, okay? So for example, how, uh, how do they work? Match. Um, we have uh, match works very easily. You just write match, which value you want to look for, for example, ILX, and which array do you want to look for. So for example, I'll look in column C from the four to the thousand, whatever. And uh, then you have the values, if you want an exact one or not, you will basically always use, a lot of times use the zero. Um, so what it's saying now is I've said, look for the value ILX in my C column and uh, find an exact match. And he said it is in the second row, so one, two, that's true because it returns as, as we look at it, returns the first one it finds. So um, now how, how does, in, so it returns a position. How does index work? Index works uh, the other way around. You give it an array. For example, uh, C4 to C1000, and uh, a column number, and you say number two, and it returns the, the value, okay? So how can we combine the two to get the value? Uh, we can say, for example, please uh, return uh, from, um, from uh, the array C4 until um, H8, uh, no, H100, okay? Uh, which row, the row which matches, where you can find the value A2 in the column, C4 to C4000, yeah. and with an exact match. And that's it. And uh, C4 to 100 match. Let me see, got something missing. C4 row number. Um, return that. Picturing the value uh, in position where you found a two and uh, give me yeah, give me one, two, three, four, five, six. The column six. So what I've basically said is in the table in the array in this array, look for the match where uh, where uh, in column C we have ILX and give me back uh, the the column six. So it's like a VLOOKUP, except if you do um, something like, you can basically look for any value. For example, we can, um, we can change this. We can say, we can change this and we can, um, Say please give me which mod which make it belongs to. So we're basically here looking for looking in a t in the whole in this whole table a to um, a to h a value in the middle and returning the column to the left. So this solves one of the problems that we had. It can look to the left, to the right, or wherever. Uh, the next problem we said is uh, we can. Uh, with VLOOKUP, we can only look for one condition. Um, 
So what we are going to do now, for example, is we're going to create an index. We're going to do an index, look for the value in a column that matches um, uh, the matches uh, two conditions. Okay. Uh, what we're doing here is if we're saying with a value one, is it true? And with a zero, is it false? So if if it returns to the one, this condition will be obeyed. Uh, it will return true if it's zero, it is false. So what condition are we creating? We're creating two conditions. One in, in column column uh, C has to uh, have the value A2 and column D column D has to have the value B2. So we're basically looking in the table for uh, that cell where uh, the model is ILX and the displacement is 2.4. It match would return a one in that column, and the uh, it, uh, it would re return a one in that in that case. Um, so we'll basically say if it's true or not, and then we will meet the six uh, value six uh, value in column six of the of the array. Uh, if we click that, it'll say it's uh, it'll give an error because it's looking for two conditions. It needs an array. You know, for an array, you have to Click on Control Shift Enter, and there we have it. We have uh, looked for the table, uh, looked in this table, seen where the model is ILX and the displacement is 2.4, and it says it is the value that it returns is the is the combined one H with value 25. So we will go back to that. Look in that table. The match where it's true that these two values, uh, the conditions are uh, set, uh, and return column six. Basically, very easy. But as you can see, you can put as many conditions as you want. So that basically gives you a lot of power to the index and max uh, function.